Okay, welcome back to Southern Bell Tarot. This reading is going to be a, over the death of Mia Kanu. So listen to this with me. Mystery surrounds the death of this beautiful college senior. She was very beautiful. Mia Kanu was found lying in the middle of the street with severe head trauma. Now many are asking if she was pushed or did she fall out of a moving car. It's just really hard for me to understand why someone would just leave her. Her mother Bianca tells our Stephen Fabian she's desperate for answers. They treated her like trash. You must be furious. Nobody called 911. Nobody came back around. So, if that's your friend, I want to be a vet friend in animals. The 23-year-old was studying veterinary medicine at Tennessee State University. She was back home outside Detroit for the summer and was hanging out with several new friends she had made. Did you have concerns about this group of friends? I did. There was just some things that uh, weren't adding up for me as a mom. The night of her death started out innocently. Mia headed to a house party where authorities say there was an argument. Mia left the party and reportedly got into a car with two acquaintances, a man and a woman. Mia was believed to have been in the back seat, the other two people up front. The next thing I know is that they do have surveillance of her being pushed or falling or being uh, put out of a vehicle. Cops have not released the video. Mia's body was found at this intersection on June 3rd at 4.30 a.m. No matter which way I spin it, I just really can't put it together. This is, this is traumatic. Two days later, Mia was pronounced dead. Doctors were able to harvest her organs. <laughs> Mia was celebrated with an honor walk. Hospital staff lined the hallway as Mia, still on life support, was wheeled down the corridor. You can hear her mother weeping. I'm sorry. I didn't watch to that part. I, I, I watched the beginning, but I didn't um, finish the video when I... Um, watched it and I just can't as a nurse because those are like the I've never worked in a med surge environment um, or like a critical care environment or ICU or anything like that but you see those videos all the time when they honor people who donate their organs and it's just like the Okay, so we are going to dig deep into this and see what happened to Miss Mia Spirit. Can you tell us what happened to Mia? This is quick. We have the Page of Wands. Okay. Eight of Pentacles is reversed. The Judgment is reversed. Five of Pentacles is reversed. The Seven of Cups is reversed. Three of Cups is reversed. This is the Six of Pentacles reversed. So what's interesting is that this deck is, what is it? The Wandering Star deck. It has words in the cards. And this is this says friends, joy, abundance. Friends, joy, and abundance. And of course, the Three of Cups is about partying is about celebration and then in the seven of cups card it actually has words written on the um, cups one of them is choice the other is instinct the other is passion and then the last one is extreme so four out of the seven cups have words written on them the tower is at the bottom and then the star is reversed the queen of cups is reversed okay what are you this is the queen of swords reversed The first thing we have is we have two women presenting themselves, um, two older women and one younger woman. So she was 23 years old, I think I heard. So I would say two of these women are older than her and then one is younger than her. 
because 23 isn't old. When you think of older women, I would think of anybody over. I'm not going to say that because age, I don't want to go there. But so two of these young women were older than her. And it could be by a year. It could be by a month or even a day. Just that's how we would identify them. And then one was younger than her. But in that car, there was only a man and a woman. So one of these people has, a, since my nose is starting, I'm starting to snip all of a sudden. They have like, they've had like a um, septum surgery. And septum is the nose. This is part of the nose. The moon is right here. Eight of Swords is right here. This is the Eight of Cups reversed. The Queen of Wands is here reversed. So we have three three women who are older than her. in a hospital setting a hospital okay one of these women works in a hospital setting and spirit is concerned about her being employed there this is death um, because she's a risk to the patients so one of these women is in a hospital setting or some type of environment where she works with a vulnerable population Give me a second. I got Whew. these cards are falling. And cards fall. But for some reason I can't see some somebody works with the elderly. So that's I was gonna say hospital, a nursing home. So that's a very vulnerable population. Fashion designer, health and wellness, interior designer. Somebody doesn't work. Scammer. I was about to say that. <laughs> then we have social services, which in that in that is someone who works with people who are vulnerable. Un yeah, somebody doesn't work because this is the car. The car, not the car. I almost said, I meant to say the card. The car. Okay, so whoever owns somebody who owns maybe who owns the car doesn't have a job. Owner of the car doesn't have a job, possibly. This is all legend of coordinate spirit. Um, some things may be right, some may be wrong. So one of these women works in a hospital setting. Hospital or a medical setting. Possibly with an elderly population. Or they could be employed by a very rich family who owns a clothing brand or an interior design brand. Like they may own um, a furniture store. Or a clothing store. Then we have someone who's a scammer, or 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 steals a lot. Oh, one of these women may have helped another woman steal from this family she works for, and this can be the people involved or people around them as well. Okay. Somebody moves jobs a lot. Someone worked once worked at a dental office because Dennis was at the bottom and then I'm looking at the death in this day, those teeth. Somebody may be a dental hygienist. I'm just looking to see what deck I want to use. Let's see. Was it an accident spirit or was she pushed out of that vehicle? So nice 20 years of age. She was pushed. 
got so much health and wellness came out remember that some one of these women is an incredibly strong she may work out when i think the will of fortune i think of like the uh, a car rolling Wands. I can't remember all of what queens came out in this deck though. Let me see. Maybe I didn't put them all. I didn't. We got a queen of swords. We have a queen of cups. Another queen of wands. So the Queen of Wands has presented herself twice. There was a fight before and Mia put up a hell of a fucking fight. Frustrated this woman because I think she was trying to push her out or hurt her. She put up a fight and she didn't like that. See, this is the Ten of Cups reverse. It says betrayal by someone close, guilt, loss of friendship. This was, a, this was due to envy, possibly over a man. It could be. Someone may be homeless because this is lost a home or possessions. And I thought about that as I looked at the um, five of pentacles. This is the eight of swords presenting itself again. We have the justice reversed. The seven of cups is presenting itself again. King of Wands. Okay, so this is giving the energy, okay, of at the core of this is of course jealousy. Uh, of of Mia, I think they did say she was a senior. Jealous that she was graduating and on to good things. This is the I think the person responsible is not the person that she was initial. She was introduced to this person through another friend. Am I right, Spirit? Yeah. Cups is here. So we've had the King of Swords. We have the Queen of Swords and the King of Swords. Now we have the Queen. We've had the Queen of Cups and now King of Cups. Four Swords right here. Yeah. The Empress. That's how they viewed her. What is this possessive energy about? Possessive about a change. What was the motive? We know it's jealousy, but what would the motive be? Jealousy, this Queen of Wands, she was beautiful and about to make a lot of money and she's about to be successful. She was a star. She worked very hard. This is crazy. This is super crazy. Um, this was pure D jealousy. She was taking the attention from another woman Queen of Wands may have a deeper skin tone. Thank you. This, she's a Queen of Swords, a very smart woman. Very smart. 
there could be so maybe there's two women like i said because i put three right maybe mia is this queen of swords strength ambition and truth that's those are the words that are here and i think the strength so this is what 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 is pissing this one the woman off the queen of wands who i think is responsible this is mia represents the queen of wands in this sense as she's very beautiful she encompasses all of the queen energy the queens but if i had to put her like as a, a court card as who she would be she would be this queen of swords this woman wanted to bully me and oh shit give me a second and this is crazy because this is kind of it's kind of uh, mirroring a, a situation that i'm dealing with myself and i say that because um all, all too often beautiful women sometimes can be mistaken for being weak as if oh they won't fight back or they won't do nothing they won't bite back this woman did not anticipate Mia putting, I think Mia and this woman have been going head to head when they are together through mutual friends for quite some time. She don't like the fact that she couldn't bully Mia. Mm -mm. That's what it was. And she is was offended. Mia is probably the only woman. And I mean, this woman has been bullying people for a long time that has ever stood up to her and held her ground. Not just verbally, because it, it, start, it starts with verbal insults. But then when it got physical, Mia was putting up a, 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 a fight, a hell of a fight, more of a fight than that woman anticipated and that enraged her. It really pissed her off because this woman is probably either bigger than Mia or works out. So let me go back to the, I'm going to write this down. Normally when I do these type of readings, I don't write things down, but I feel like it's important to do in this case. So my queen of swords is Miss Mia. Then we got the queen, we got the queen of wands. And I think she's the culprit. I think the queen of wands is used to being the prettiest person in the room. The one that gets all the attention. Mia coming home for the summer, starting to hang around these people, took that away from her. She's very insecure. And then the only people, the queen of swords, we did have a king of swords. And then we also had a king of cups, we had a king of cups, right? If we didn't, it's okay. Let me see. I'm pretty sure it was the King of Cups. Or it could have been the King of Wands. It doesn't matter. But I think it's the, it's the King of Swords that somebody would... This is wild. I can't tell y'all how wild it is. But I'll tell you. I know the story because I, I know the story. This, this Queen of Wands has the nerve to think that this um, King of Swords would even want her. That's what this is. It's the king of swords that somehow happens to be around these low vibrational women that had his eyes on her, I think. Or if they go out and party, the men that, you know, are the catches are the ones that are, they now, instead of looking at this queen of wands, they're looking at this queen of swords. Because Mia embraces like and embodies all the um, queen energy. She's beautiful and she's intelligent. And again, I think that this was a woman she knew through enough this Queen of Cups. This Queen of Cups is Queen of Cups, Cups represent emotions. This is this Queen of Cups is not intimidated by other women. She knows the this Queen of Wands has the tendency to be nasty towards other women. But the Queen of Cups, in comparison to the King of Cups, she has her cup extended. So she's open to making new friends, and she brought Mia into the friend group. And this person, the Queen of Wands, didn't like it. Even though it was temporary, even just being around for a summer was too much. That makes sense. So the Queen of Cups is, I think, the friend. I'm gonna put first friend, and then next to my Queen of Wands, I'm gonna put introduced by the Queen of Cups. Introduced to Mia. To Mia. So as it relates to the man and the woman in the car with Mia, let's go there. As it relates to them, the man and woman in the car, was that King of Swords, the man in the car? My computer is about to die. 
and I need to make sure that I have a slim grab my it's right here. You second guys. Give me a second. Something else I'm getting. But when I did that I hit my chandelier in my kitchen. The name of the person who sings that song, I want to swing from a chandelier, may be the name of one of these people involved or the nickname or something. And I, I think it's what, Sia? I think that's her. Let me find her name. But it may not be the, it may not be the stage name, it may be her real name. This woman chain smokes. One of them, Sia. Sia is the, her name. What's her real name? That could be her real name, but let's see if she has Sia's real name. Loene Furler. Let's see. This says Kate Isabel Furler. Oh, her parents are Loene and Phil. But her name, see his name is Kate Isabel Furler. So Kate or Isabel may be important. They may have siblings this name or children that name as well. They have these names as well. Somebody may use acid. Justice is reversed. Five of Cups is reversed. The Five of Wands is reversed. Judgment is upright. The Queen of Cups is reversed. Queen of Cups is ate up by this situation. The Knight of Cups, this woman that introduced Mia to this other person might have a son. The King of Pentacles is reversed. Talk about the Eight of Pentacles. The Four of Pentacles. There's somebody's married. The Hierophant is reversed and the Four of Wands is upright. The Seven of Wands is here. It's given the energy of somebody's husband or boyfriend was attracted to her. The King of Swords can be a divorced man or their marriage has fallen apart. Whose man was it that was attracted to Mia? It wasn't just other men, it was somebody's man or ex-boyfriend or ex-husband. The person who may be a Scorpio or a Leo or a Sagittarius. Fire sign, Leo's, Leo, Aries, or Sag. And remember, our Queen of Wands, yep. Wands represent Leo, at um, Sagittarius. Leo, Aries, and Sag, my God. So this Queen of Wands, ex-boyfriend, ex-husband, baby daddy, somebody. I don't think he ever verbalized liking Mia. I think he just paid too much attention to her for her own liking. He may be a Scorpio. A November Scorpio. The Ace of Cups is reversed. Eight of Wands is up. Ten of Pentacles. Not, I was going to say Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, so they were married or lived together. The Ten of Swords is the one card in the tarot we say represents literal death. Uh, the 
Queen of Wands. Here this, here this bitch come again. This Queen of Wands is the person responsible for me as death. The Three of Cups. But all of them know. All three of those women. Well, all of, but, well both of the women know. Or this could be me and the two women. Yeah. Mm -hmm. King of Swords is reversed. Let's keep going. The Five of Wands. There's a lot of arguing about this right now. Seven of Wands. Somebody's trying to distance themselves from it. And it says King of Pentacles reversed. Who is this King of Pentacles? So now we didn't have the King of Swords. I think it was either the King of Wands or the King. I think it's the King of Wands. So who's this King of Pentacles? The Five of Cups is upright. Eight of Wands and then the Ten of Swords. The King of Pentacles is the, was it the other? Yep, the Ace of Cups is reversed. He's the other, per, wait, and then this, what, the King of Swords is back out again. Seven of Swords. The Nine of Cups, he was drinking. Somebody, whoever was driving was drinking. I don't think that they were intoxicated. I don't think they were over the legal limit, though. Um, there could be concerns about that. Let me see. Interestingly enough, I think the driver of the vehicle holds a position that's um, expected not to drink and drive like a police officer or just somebody. The Four Swords. The Fool is reversed. Look at this King of Cups showing himself. And then here is the Ten of Pentacles. King of Cups is the first one. Queen of Cups is the first one. There's a method to my madness. The Knight of Wands is here. The Empress is reversed. The Lovers is here. This is somebody. She is mad over her um her baby dad. Let's pull out the Southern Bell Tarot Who Done It Oracle and see what we can get, guys. From Miss Mia. That Queen of Wands is a narcissist. Someone with useful information is afraid to come forward. Herp has been interviewed by police already. Oh, I, I thank you. Video footage of the night of the crime may be available, which they said that already. Someone may be considering in, ending their own life over this situation. DNA evidence may be available. The perpetrator lives within 30 miles of where this happened. A love triangle is involved. This crime was an act of revenge. The perpetrator felt the victim wronged them in some way. Perpetrator is a family member. So there may be some relation, relation between these two queens, the Queen of Wands and the Queen of Cups. Someone assisted the perp with covering their, crime, their tracks after the crime. Again, someone with useful information is afraid to come forward. Someone has a, conscious, a conscience. A key witness is not being truthful about what they know about the crime. She was strangling Mia. Thank you, Spirit. There's something else that this person, this queen, this queen of wands was involved in. Another crime that Mia may have known about but not known about like it happened, but I don't know how to describe it. Like, what is the other crime that this Queen of Wands was in, engaged in? What was that crime about? Give me a second, guys. The moon is reversed. The Three of Swords is reversed. The Two of Pentacles is upright. Prostitution. The Ace of Cups is upright. The Queen of Swords is upright. Prostitution or like scamming. But then I say someone was a scammer. Like, yep, something like that. She's also a prostitute. Selling her body. That may have led to the breakup of her and this man. May have. Whatever it, other crime she did, it involved the internet. Because look at the world right there. And then that's the Five of Cups again. 
and it involved taking from vulnerable people i think too i'm getting that too so we have the five of cups here again again there is a lot of guilt by somebody these the queen of wands and the queen of cups may both be a fire sign king of pentacles is here again i'm wondering where he fits in in this equation because he just don't fit in but he does he keeps coming out who is this king of pentacles is it who is this king of pentacles If it's a financial crime, the King of Pentacles is the one that's helping this Queen of Wands find these victims. And his position may be like something where he's supposed to be protecting their information with the Queen of Pentacles. Yep, they're working together in some type of financial enterprise crime. Yep, higher font. Look at this. Yep, he works for a bank. And look at this King of Swords. He can also be very intelligent as well. That's crazy. Now they're telling him to go use both decks. Okay, we have the, and it don't matter. Reversals aren't mattering. The Three of Wands is right here. They've been doing this for a long time. Now he's trying to walk, they're trying to stop doing it. This crime is going to lead to the fact that they don't know that they was doing this as well. Quickly, the Eight of Wands is right here. He's going to try to separate himself, but he can't. The Queen of Swords is here again. I think they were worried. If, one of them's definitely a Sag um, out of the Fire Sign people. He, that Mia is so intelligent that they were worried that she may have picked up on what they were doing. But I don't think she really, I mean, if she paid enough attention, she would have. But no, the hangman is right here. The high priestess is right here reversed. Let's see, justice is right here. I'm telling y'all, she knew. Yeah, this person works in, this man works in a trusted position where he's supposed to be guarding information, but he's instead giving it up to this queen of wands so she can manipulate people. He's trying to separate himself from this as much as possible. The Six of Swords is here. But it's not going to work, buddy. Like, you're, uh-uh. Eight of Cups is reversed. The Seven of Swords is, nope. It's not working. It's not working. It's going to, the more they investigate Mia's murder, and it was a murder, the more they're going to um, uncover the other stuff that the, this lady was involved in as well. She's the type that if I go down, I'm going to start telling that I was doing other things too. So this person can go to jail too. That's what this energy is giving. I think he may be the person that may contemplate committing, ending his life because um, it would be shameful and it would be publicly embarrassing. And remember, this is all legend according to spirit. Um, tarot is subjective. I could be right. I could be wrong. So it's not just poverty right yet and thief. Child, I can't make it up cars don't <laughs> it like um they were already stealing from people who it's it's giving um subprime lending something like that like message right here occupation um wealthy man he got rich doing this message of concern oh don't be concerned now high honor i'm telling you he holds, he holds a high position expectation is there and then official person yep so that's another element. When when this Queen of Wands is called, she's going to tell about some financial, some crime where they was over there getting money off people. A lot of it. They got rich doing it. Um, I just don't. This. Let me go back in this again. Then I'm gonna be done. This was not a suicide. Ooh, they may. We got, a, we got another tangent we can go off on. Somebody may try to look, make somebody look like they committed suicide. This crime was committed to cover up for a previous crime committed by the perpetrator. I'm telling you, there's an element of this backstory crime, this other thing. Perp has been interviewed by police, but we know that. Um, that 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 factors in significantly with this. Okay, that's... Okay. Rico is here. It could be considered federal. I'm not going to accept those other ones again. I said I think that she... And I, I think the strang, strang, strangulation with their hands thing is what pissed this Queen of Wands off. Because she was doing it. And normally, you know, people will pass out or something. But Mia what, did, fought back. Probably even got out of her grasp. And that pissed her off. Because she's used to choking people out. Um, she is. She's a very evil person. Very, very evil person. Mm -hmm. Give me some descriptive characteristics of the Queen of Wands only. I want descriptive characteristics of the Queen of Wands only. Because she's the one that I... You, you can break down at Queen... Um, the Queen of Cups. She has a unique first name. 
She has a unique sense of style. That's where the fashion thing comes in. She has a few extra pounds. She drives a luxury car. I'm telling you, she's getting rich. She's very attractive herself. I want to say this speaks a love, another language, struggling financially. It's crazy because it's like all this money, but she was blowing it at, at the same time. It's weird. Mama's boy is here. She might have a young, a young son, college educated. She has sibling, a lot of siblings, um, famous or well-known in the local area. She's really well-known, black hair, comes from humble beginnings. This man may have a beard. Okay, and this is what I have, and I love you guys, and until next time.